tells, you know, he said that he's not going to leave office, right? Now, here's the thing. The entire country, the entire world basically is dragging this guy, trolling this guy, rightfully so, because he lied about what color the sky is and what color grass is. He just lies. So he's rightfully getting trolled, rightfully getting dragged through the mud. And like I said, he's going to start getting frustrated by this. Naturally, he's going to get annoyed and he's going to show it, which is only going to make things worse. But um, yesterday we covered again how uh, George Santos, he, he, he stole three thousand dollars from a from a fucking disabled veterans fund uh, for his dog. He stole that. And then it got outed that he was a drag queen at some point named Katara. I don't know if you've seen uh, what was it? Uh, the last airbender guitar was like the main character. I don't know if they had anything to do with it because George Santos isn't that old. I'm 30. George Santos is mid 30s, like 34, 35 or some shit like that. So I don't know if that's what Katara came from, but he definitely was in the age range to have been watching the last airbender when he was a kid, basically. So let's get into into this, because he made a tweet that I thought was rather funny that that show what I said. He's going to get frustrated, but he, he doesn't have any leverage. OK, so he's denying that he performed as a drag queen. But, you know, he's that's besides the point. This is really this is this is really OK. He he called reports that he performed in drag more than 14 years ago at, quote, outrageous lie like, oh, yes, yes, yes. Yeah, George Santos calling out the lies. People like this kill me. You know, it's like they get caught red handed and it's like and, and, and it's like every they get caught for everything they did. Right. And then they 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 pinpoint one tiny little minute detail of the case. And it's like, oh, no, 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 that's wrong. Like, OK, well, overall, you're still pretty fucking guilty, let alone. But let's get into this tweet. OK, because this goes into exactly what I was saying he's going to do. Right. So. The most recent obsession from the okay, here he goes. The most recent obsession from the media claiming that I am a drag queen or performed as a drag queen is categorically false. So tell them, George, let these motherfuckers know that they lying on your name. The media continues to make outrageous claims about my life while I am working to deliver results. I will not be distracted nor phased by this. This, this dude is out of his mind. He is out of his mind. And then we go, you know, again, here's some like pictures of him. <laughs> George Santos, uh, when he was Katara as a drag queen. And, and you know, it's what I, I haven't even heard this. What is he saying? Hey, everyone. George Santos here, congressional candidate in New York's third congressional district. Let's talk real quick about the Florida bill. Don't say gay. Although the bill doesn't mention those words. OK, that's unrelated. That's just a. I guess they're just putting a compilation of, of his stuff together in this article. But really, I wanted to show this specifically for this tweet, because I told you he's going to get frustrated by this shit. I told you, man. Exactly. Exactly. You know what I'm saying? He like, keep my name out. Keep my drag name out your mouth. You feel me? Like, but it's just like, you know, look at this. The media continues to make outrageous claims about my life while I am working to deliver results. It's like. Bro, your entire campaign was ran off of lies. Like, he makes Donald Trump look like a good Samaritan. Because, again, I have to say it again, most people, even if they're huge liars, their lies make sense. They're lying to cover something up. Or they're lying to trick people into supporting X, Y, and Z. They don't typically, oh, this damn refrigerator making too much noise. Oh, it stopped. Okay. They typically don't lie about... You know, it'll be like, this is a black mug. I know it looks white, but it's black. That's the level of lies from George Santos. So, again, for him to say the media continues to make outrageous claims about my life, like, I, I can't even put myself in his shoes. Like, what the fuck world are you living in? And then he says, I will not be distracted nor phased by this. Like, yes, because you're such a valiant white knight for the people. Like, what are you going to do? Like, what, what are you really going to do? What are, what are your plans really, man? Like, get the fuck out of here. But <laughs> that, that blew me away. It's like the, the, some people really are just fucking crazy. And this dude is nuts. This dude is crazy. They gave him a couple of committee assignments though. 
because the Republicans were afraid. They said, we're afraid of the precedent that might be set if we don't allow him to be on committees because of allegations like, are y'all serious? Sounds more like y'all got a whole lot of skeletons in the closet such that you're connect. I mean, to, 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 so to connect yourself to George Santos, like, Oh, I might be in a position like George Santos, like really now, because I don't have that worry. I don't go about my life feeling like, Oh, I might get exposed for all of these lies because I don't go around, you know, lying about my life and who I am and shit like that. But I thought that was rather stunning. Like this dude has absolutely no self-awareness. Yeah, you're a victim, right? Everyone's just making shit up about you. 